kids. Today we're going to read about Joseph the Dreamer. And you can find this story in the Old Testament in Genesis. Let's go. Adventure Bible. Joseph the Dreamer. Joseph had a lot of brothers. Joseph was the youngest, and he was his father's favorite. One day, Joseph's father gave him a robe. It had many colors. Joseph loved it. When Joseph's brothers saw his robe, they were jealous. They asked, why don't we get new robes? What makes Joseph so special? Then Joseph had a dream. He told his brothers, last night, I dreamed we were picking grain. Your bunches of grain all bowed down to mine. Joseph's brothers were upset. They asked, does he think he is better than us? Does he think we should bow to him? They made a plan to get rid of Joseph. One day, Joseph was out in a field. His brothers grabbed him. They threw him in an empty well. Joseph was scared. He didn't understand why his brothers hated him, and the well was dark. Then someone threw down a rope. They pulled Joseph out. Joseph's brothers told him, we're selling you as a slave. Joseph's brothers dipped his colorful robe in goat's blood. They showed their father. They said, your son has been killed by a wild animal. Joseph's father was very, very sad. Joseph traveled with the slave traders. They went all the way to Egypt. In Egypt, Joseph was sold to a rich man. The rich man threw Joseph in jail. Joseph hadn't even done anything wrong. But God was with Joseph. In jail, Joseph met a man who used to be the king's servant. The servant had a dream. He said to Joseph, I dreamed I made a drink from grapes. Then I gave the drink to the king. Can you tell me what this means? Joseph said, God knows about your dream. It means that soon you will work for the king again. Joseph was right. A few days later, the servant got out of jail. Don't forget about me, Joseph said to him. Later, the king had a dream. No one could tell him what it meant. But the king's servant remembered, Joseph can tell you what your dream means, he said. The king sent for Joseph. He told Joseph his dream. Joseph said, lots of food will grow for seven years. Then the food will stop growing. God wants us to save food now so we won't be hungry later. The king was impressed. He put Joseph in charge of all the food in Egypt. Everything Joseph said came true. For seven years, lots of food grew. Then the seven bad years began. Even Joseph's family did not have enough to eat. Joseph's father sent his sons to buy food in Egypt. When Joseph's brothers arrived, they bowed to Joseph. It was just like Joseph's dream, but they did not know he was their brother. Joseph knew. Joseph sold his brother's food and they went home. Later, the brothers came back to buy more food. They bowed to Joseph again. This time, Joseph said, don't you recognize me? I'm your brother, Joseph. His brothers were afraid. Would Joseph hate them for what they had done? 
But Joseph said, I forgive you. What you did to me was bad, but God used it for good. They all hugged. The brothers rushed home. They told their father, Joseph is alive. Soon the whole family moved to Egypt. The end. I hope you enjoyed today's story about Joseph.